Hi, this is DH Dunn, and I'm here to ask myself a very basic question. Can I lope 10 days on a budget? First off, we have some stuff to talk about. So, um, it has been uh, a bit of a 24 hours, and uh, one of the things that happened over the past day was yesterday's recording was lost. Um, I'd love to blame technology. It was my own screw up. Uh, I accidentally deleted it uh, while cleaning up some files and uh, really got to make sure that I've got the day's editing done before I do that. I'm kind of constrained on hard drive space. Um, so I do go through and kind of clean up videos and I just, it's completely on me and I apologize. Uh, I think it's the first time this year that I haven't been able to, you know, I've had to skip ahead with a lot of games you would just load an earlier save, but uh, of course the long dark doesn't work that way. Fortunately, nothing of great excitement. Uh, I hate to say that because it makes it sound like the episode was going to be boring, but nothing of, of earth-shaking excitement uh, uh, transpired. Uh, we will go through it. I have um, reverse engineered, I think, almost all of my spending. Uh, let's load up the game. You will see that we are in uh, Coastal Highway now. Basically, all we did was go from the bingo parlor to um, to Quonset, and uh, I I I did have one wolf interaction on the way up to the mine uh, on the uh, Pleasant Valley side, but I mean, you know, I avoided him. It was I thought it was an interesting wolf interaction, you know, but that's gone so i picked up a ton of coal uh in the mine and uh then made my way pretty directly i stopped at the fire tower and made a few purchases there which we'll go over and then um i went in the little bunny houses if you know the bunny i call them the bunny houses there if, if you if you go down from the fire tower there's these little houses the bear walks by there and uh, I might have picked up something. One of the items I'm going to read off, I might have picked up there. Then I went into Quonset. I gave a big speech about Quonset, which I probably will give again. Um, and also the uh, house that's kind of off to the corner by Quonset. And I did get matches there. So let's get back into it. Oh, and I did a bunch of cooking. So I think I got cooking too. Let's confirm that first. Cooking two. Yes, we did make cooking two. Um, you can see we have well fed now and uh, water wise we are in great shape food wise meh. <laughs> we got 26 cattails so we have to remember that if we're going to go to DP which I probably will um, uh, DP doesn't have any cattails I believe it is the only region with zero cattails in it uh, not counting you know places like crumbling uh, which I think also has none uh, okay, so what did I spend money on? We're starting with $20. Uh, I bought this book. <laughs> I feel like I'm coming back from the store. I bought the, this book. I bought uh, some matches. Um, we did get some oats, a second thing of oats. Uh, I, I'm, there's $2 I can't account for, and it might be this syrup. I think I may have picked this up. I did pick up this oil. Um, we have a lantern. What are you doing? Don't take that. Don't take the antiseptic, okay? That's not why it's here. Um, we do have a lantern now. So we got that. Um, and I think that accounts for 18 of the $20. So matches for six, lantern for two, oats for two, that's 10. Oh, wait, the most important purchase of the day, the stint. Two dollars for a stem that puts us at twelve. The book is fourteen. Antiseptic is sixteen. Oil is eighteen. I don't know where the other two dollars is. I don't know. Maybe I tipped somebody. I don't know. We have this. Um, I could eat anything. Parka. Like it's probably the parka. Now that I think about it. Yeah. Why are we not wearing that? Uh, yes. I think because I wanted to see which one was better. Okay. So there's your twenty dollars, and I have twenty dollars to spend. And uh, we are on basically day six. So, again, my apologies for the lost uh, episode. We're going to spend some time in Coastal today. And um, still looking for a hacksaw. I think the hacksaw is kind of the big, where is it? So I have gone through Coastal uh, or Quonset here. I've, I've well, I've checked some of these things. 
You know me, I always leave at least something. I haven't bought any water from the toilets. I did not take this whetstone, because right now I have nothing to sharpen, so what would the point be? Uh, simple tools, same reason. No use for it. Uh, I did very much want to do some fishing, maybe. But we would need to get some guts. I'm not taking these candy bars and stuff. Chips. You know, they're there if I need them. Uh, I can't get... A pry bar would be nice, too. So, I think down the street... Um, there's a trailer and a house. And uh, there's some more stuff to check. So, let's go head out that way. And I will talk about Quonset while I'm here. So Coastal Highway, uh, I didn't, okay, maybe not. Maybe we're going to stay here. We'll check this car instead. Uh, Coastal Highway is one of my favorite maps, and I did not know this until I did my map ranking video. And I assigned the different scores to the different maps, and lo and behold, Coastal Highway right on top. Um, I think it's a solid map across the board. And the thing that most people ding Coastal Highway for is where I am right now, Quonset. And in my opinion, as I set myself up to be attacked by a wolf, I don't think Quonset's that bad. Uh, I don't think it's I don't think it's any more dangerous than um, uh, the workshop in Broken Railroad. And I really. I really don't think it's that bad. You crouch when you go out the door. There's there's a good way to come at Quonset so that you know if anything's waiting for you. And honestly, it's very rare that I've had a problem here. Um, I think Quonset has a rep, and you know this is only my opinion. And I'm not saying if you hate Quonset or fear Quonset, you're wrong. Uh, but if you haven't tried it, give it a chance as a base. I feel like Quonset is actually a pretty strong location. There are other areas that make me much more nervous than this one. Yes, it is on two bear routes. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> I like coastal, though, and I like the coastal bears because they're pretty predictable in where they go and what they do. I understand their setup better. Uh, they are always up, as far as I know. Um, we could read. Since we paid for the damn book, maybe we read it for an hour. Then we let Will eat something. Like a cattail. This is why I want to go fishing. But I need some things to go fishing. I have no anything. Right now, all I can do is look at the fish. We could, however, beachcomb. Now... Beachcombing, I don't know. I didn't have a rule for beachcombing. That seems like I shouldn't have to pay for that. That shit was just came in off the water. <laughs> I don't know. I like beachcombing. Beachcombing is fun. It's like it's like playing a lottery. It's like playing a little game. Now, I don't know that I've ever seen the candy bar here. With the big hook through it. Like, that's clearly through the candy bar. I don't want a candy bar that had a hook through it. That's not good. I shake my head. Blizzards have really been kicking my butt over the past couple days. Shake my head. Okay, I do not want to spend two dollars on food. I could just make more porridge. And more water. Or I could read the book again. How about we read the book again? Go ahead and have a drink, Will. Maybe the problem is I'm going out the wrong door. I need to go out this door and then it won't be blizzarding. Nope. Okay. Oh, well, fine. Back to reading, Will. I feel like Will would be reading here. He would be like sitting on the bed. Not standing in the middle of a room breathing. I didn't crouch. 
Hey, all right. I want to go out the front, though. All right, all right, all right. So, the thing in Coastal that scares me the most is getting lost on the ice. That is definitely the thing I am most afraid of. And, um, normally, I feel like this is going to go out if I use it. Normally, I would walk on the ice, and I think I might because I'm going to stay near the coast. Now we could check these houses over here. Free sticks. Okay, we are looking for hacksaw, pry bar. Um, not banging the microphone. Hope nobody needs uh, this anymore. No. No, I, I, I don't think so. Uh, I can't remember the last time I saw a flare gun in a bathtub. Come on. When did we stop putting flare guns in bathtubs? We, as a nation, or as a community, really need to get back to that. There is a place for a flare gun, and it is a bathtub. is a wash out a potato i mean am i gonna spend two dollars on a potato i don't know how many calories is a potato if you cook it does it say no it's highly nutritious never been so hungry according to the description it does raise my cooking skill i mean so does anything that's <laughs> so does anything you cook it does warm you up so it's got that. I mean, again, it's it's not that different from, like, peaches or something, though. What has it got going for it that peaches doesn't? Like a can of peaches, a can, can of tomato soup. Like these peaches. Okay, these are in good condition. I think I will purchase these. Where's my D20? Screw it. We're not doing the D20. We're just writing it down. 18. I might take the potato. I'm taking the potato. 16. This, by the way, <laughs> this was a gift to me by my job because my job knows how much I love whiteboards. So they gave me a whiteboard that you can wear on your wrist. <laughs> I love it. I don't think they thought I would actually use it, but they didn't know me very well because I... My whole freaking room here is whiteboards. <laughs> I whiteboard everything. Okay. Uh, ice? Ice? Maybe. It's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that one. <laughs> Oh, guys, I'm having a good time today. I feel bad about the lost part, but um, I, I'm having a good time. Nothing I can do. All right, Wolvies are over there. There's, um, oh, the crazy guy's house. Um, I can't remember. Jackrabbits is over there. Hobbit bear is not up. We call him the Hobbit bear because that bear has ended runs for all four hobbits. Me... Car with thistle, very tiny burb, the peach bee, all of us have had had multiple probably runs ended by that stupid bear. Because he walks down that road, and there's that spot there where you kind of can't see if he's there or not, and then he can kind of sneak up on you. But for me, 
I there's a deer carcass that's usually out there and I was cooking that deer carcass in the fog and he came out of the fog at me like some kind of freaking nightmare. It was terrifying. <laughs> I had no idea. He's just suddenly he's just charging at me and that was I actually I don't think I died from that one, but man, it was probably my scariest long dark moment. Hey, I would like some good items, please. Oh, I've been here? Great. Fantastic. The one freaking fishing hut I've already been to. Give me the good stuff. You know, the good stuff. So yeah, my number one fear in Coastal is getting lost on the ice. And later loper runs, I usually, from all the fishing huts, will have... Um, uh, tinder trails that will point point me to the shore so that I know just what direction to go. You know, it'd just be like an arrow made out of uh, tinder. I could use a spray paint. I don't know. I never pick up the spray paint. I kind of pretend it's not there. This is very useful. I've seen players do very smart things with spray paint, especially inside caves. It's probably great in HRV. I'm sure I'll come around on it. I'm never coming around on the flares, though. There's no other use for the stupid flares. If you're not doing signal signal void hidden echo thing, then you don't need it. I guess unless you really wanted to trigger an aurora for some reason, you could use them for that. Um, I don't think so. I can't spend my money on something that I could just make. I mean, granted, I can't. <laughs> I don't have anything. I have no hacksaw. I have no hatchet. No, no nothing. So I guess I can't make it. That's an hour and a half of fire for two dollars. I don't know. Now I'm starting to think I, I made a bad decision there. But I could be coming up on potentially some free food. Yup, I'll take it. Probably won't be much. Hey, 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 hey. That's not how we do things around here. Could get blizzarded out. Some of you may die, but that is a chance I am willing to take. We're going to get this fire first time. Nice. Yeah, throw another coal in there. What am I worried about? What am I going to spend two freaking dollars for firewood on? I got to wait for you. So while we're waiting, we can make a, some porridge. You need to eat soon. And a potato. We spent money for that potato. We spent good money on that potato. <laughs> At least this is a pretty safe place to cook where, you know, if a blizzard kicks up, you can go, um, you can run to the trailers. You shouldn't be, even I shouldn't get lost here. I say that. I don't know that I have a rock. I should have at least one. Uh, there was another feather. There it is. I'm thinking ahead. How we doing here? Okay, just checking in on you. I'm going to eat this porridge. And then make more. Porridge to me is just a machine to raise your cooking skill. I love it. It does. I mean, it's got multiple. It warms you up. We're warmed up now. I mean, we were warmed up for the fire anyway, but... 
19. I think we can go one more on the porridge. Why not? 44. Not much. Not much, but it's something. What I really want is the guts. Potatoes ready. Let me see how much calories is in a potato. 275? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Okay, we got 51 minutes left. Let's. How are we doing on water? Yeah, I used some water. Let's make a little. May I have a gut, please? Yikes. Forgot how long that was going to take. Probably just burned up everything. Yeah, well, life goes on. I'm in the no regret phase of my life. Eh. Whatever. Got the water. Uh, I need another hour, please. I need this other gut. Can we drop that one so that I'm not stinky? Let's take a look. Make sure there's no jerks patrolling around here. Looks all right. Can I have another gut, please? I could do another water, too. That would be what a smart person would do. A smart person would probably do two water. And I am not a smart person, but I play one on YouTube. <laughs> exact, except no. I've said before when, like, other Twitch streamers are talking about, you know, one of the things that, as a streamer, can be challenging is when people come into your streams and kind of tell you how to play. And, like, tell you what you're doing wrong, and, and, you know, oh, you need to do this, you need to do that, and this isn't right, and that isn't right. And that's... Usually they mean well, but, and you can't hear tone of voice in text, so you don't, but it comes off, sometimes it can come off, it's like, you know, kind of criticism, but, um, and so, sometimes it is criticism, <laughs> like, sometimes it's not like ambiguous, but, um, you know, I always say, well, just make your brand be, I'm not that good, <laughs> that's my brand, I can always fall back on it. <laughs> Yeah, but I'm not that good. And I'm not trying to be good. I'm trying to have fun. And the truth is, there are so many incredibly skilled long dark streamers. Like, in terms of gameplay skill. There's so many awesome, you know, content creators. And, you know, whatever you want to call them. YouTubers and Twitch Twitchers and whatever. Um, you know, your cup runneth over with amazing, talented, charismatic skillful players it almost sounds like i'm gonna go what are you watching me for <laughs> i mean i like to think i bring my own vibe my own energy to it i really feel like my big selling point is how much i love the game i just so 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 enjoy goofing around and uh, with this game and just this game is like a good pal that you just hang out with now did i pick something up a minute ago oh, while i, I was babbling I'm a little worried that I did. I'm not taking this fire log. I feel like I picked something up out there. Do I charge myself $2 when I don't know what I did? If I picked something up outside, it would have been like a sticks or something. It was sticks, I'm sure. You get It happens as you get older, guys. Okay, so I didn't find what I was looking for. In the words of you too, I still haven't found what I'm looking for. But I do have plenty of food now. Or calories. Um, it's getting late. I would like to get down to the fishing cabins, if weather permits. Weather and wolves permitting. Um, please just go this way. Thank you. Okay, I'm on a straight shot right now, but I'm walking into the wind, which is not great. But even if a blizzard kicks up right now, I can see the docks. So I just keep walking straight. 
don't get distracted. The problem is walking into the wind is slow and boring and I hate it. <laughs> this is the slowest sprinting ever. But I think that's kind of, you know, I've I've talked to a lot of people who thought about, well, I want to put, you know, I want to put stuff on YouTube or I've thought about putting things on YouTube. I've thought about putting things on Twitch, you know, or going on Twitch, but I'm not that good at the game. No one would want to watch me. And I almost feel like if they're looking for people who are good at the game, they already have that. Like whatever game it is you're talking about, there's already a top streamer who's incredibly good at it. And you know, if you go on Reddit and say, hey, I've just started playing, you know, Gun Battler 7, and who's the top streamer? There'll be a guy that, like, or, or a girl that most people recommend, this is who you watch. And there'll be a couple other ones. If you go on Reddit right now and say, hey, who are the top, you know, I just bought this game. Who should I watch to learn how to play the long dark? Overwhelmingly, you're going to get Zach. You will get other answers. You'll get, you know, uh, other people, and there are lots of other great streamers out there. If I start naming them now... Um, I'll leave somebody out and feel bad. So I won't do that. But that that spot's already covered. What isn't covered is your your unique groove. That's not covered. And you just got to find your groove. And, and there will be people who groove to your groove. Not everybody will. <laughs> but some people will. And that's all you do. And then you just stick it out, you know. I don't know how I got on this subject. I'm just babbling this morning. I had worked really hard to build up a good buffer of recorded, pre-recorded YouTubes. And um, this yesterday accidentally deleting one pissed me off. And so I didn't record a second time, which my plan yesterday was to record two. And instead I recorded zero. So, hey, fishing hook, part of what I'm looking for. Oh, wait, we gotta pay for that. Hey, 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 shit is not free. Shit is not free. Don, what are you, some kind of shoplifter? That's the burglar. Excuse me. <laughs> Still, this might be the first day that we end with money. No, we, we've ended days, have we? No. No, we haven't ended a day with money. We've ended parts with money. I don't think we've ended a day with money before, but I think we might end this day with money. <sighs> don't give me that you're dead music. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Okay, I want to go immediately here but not get eaten by the bear this this area scares me more than Quonset because I have come out of the door and the bear has been just there come on 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 I mean I don't want to say I'm disappointed to find matches because that would be ridiculous and I'll buy them for six dollars Which puts us at eight, but um, I'm really hoping for hacks. I have started to f find this is the item I spend the most time looking for: hacksaw, not hammer. It used to be hammer. Okay, now I I'm using matches. I don't care. I paid for them. I'm going to use them. Okay, dee 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 dee. Visual. The incredibly stuffed and full backpack that contains nothing. I guess it's just air. Like, hang on. <laughs> Look at this backpack. There is clearly something in here. <laughs> Don't tell me it's empty. What is that? Packing peanuts? What is in there? There is something there.
I'm pretty keyed up this morning. I don't know why. I did sleep very well. I went to bed early and woke up late. Candy bar? I don't think so. Could end up being useful. <laughs> no. I'm not paying two dollars for a freaking bandage. I have standards. Shaking my head. Now I'm wondering if I could run out the jackrabbits too, though. Hmm. Is it food or? Hmm. Two bucks for 300 calories. I feel like I could do better. We are overburdened finally. Here's another one of these incredibly full, empty backpacks. All right. No, I'm not taking either of those things. Do I think I can get to jackrabbits is the question. And the answer is maybe. Feels pretty risky though. Yeah. I guess we'll pass. All right. So. Now maybe I buy that stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I'll buy the, uh, the sardines for two. I feel better about spending all my money every day. And not banking it. So, I'll buy the chips and the soda for $2. So, now I'm down to two. Oh, I want to get these guts curing. Damn it. Make a note. Two guts in fishing pot. CH. No, no. Fishing hut will make me think it's one of the little houses. There. That's better. I'll figure out which house it was. Okay. Two dollars I think I can do. Let's make sure we know where the bed is. Not leave cabin. Right here, bed. Okay. Let's eat. Uh, do I have... I don't have um, antibiotics. So I'm a little nervous about eating those right now. Let's have the soda. Get a little splurge a little. Let Will have a little fun snack. Some beef jerky and a Sprite. That's good times. Good stuff. A little morale for William. All right. I feel like let's uh, sleep eight. And, um, yeah. It's not morning yet. Uh, despite the fact that I can clearly see, they're gonna say it's dark, so I can't do anything. Uh, I guess I passed time. And... I might want to go up Hack Creek. Uh, no, it's not Hack Creek. Hack Creek is in um, uh, the Muskeg. Uh, I might want to go. I might. I don't know, though. I feel like we're pretty good on food. And going up the creek is a bit risky. Definite chance of a bear encounter there. 
Um, let's just hit jackrabbits and misanthropes. That's what that thing is called. And maybe... Uh, maybe we find enough stuff to do fishing. Can, can I leave? Can I leave? I don't know how to get out. Help me. Sun is not fully over the horizon yet. We don't have our money yet. Ugh, fog. Not bad, though. It's not bad. I'll have it out. I don't like that we don't have a flare. I would definitely buy a flare. Looks like a new day is dawning. Wow. Will's chipper today. All right, Will. I'll say that that's our money. Cha-ching! 22. 22 big ones that we will probably take to Coastal Highway. Or, or we are in Coastal Highway. We, we will probably take that money to uh, Desolation Point. Want a freaking hacksaw? We might take it to Mystery Lake instead. I didn't really want to go to Mystery Lake, but the game is not giving me the things I need. Now, I have found a hacksaw in... Uh, the whale factory. So, maybe. Could just roll the dice. Maybe, uh, <laughs> can it show up in beach coffee? I don't think so. Alright, I know I joked about beach coming stuff being free. Beach coming can't be free because I didn't say that at the beginning. Hey, 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 slow down there, buddy. Easy, easy, easy. Somehow we're reaching around it to, to, to open it. Hello, sir. Might I inquire? As to your content, find some place to escape this and you cold. died. Face down in the snow. God, that's depressing. Would you want to die face down or face up? Both seem pretty awful. Okay, so one of the things I talked about in yesterday's video Done. that got lost is Archimedes put out a really cool short video about how to repair the uh, hole in the roof in Mountaineers and Timberwolf Mountain. And it's a great video. It's really, really cool. Um, I love the energy of it because it's exactly the kind of thing that I would want to do. And I definitely want to try it. He uses the Trevois and uh, a skillet to, to get on top of the roof, which is really cool. I don't know how he figured it out. So check it out. Check out Arch Archimedes. is a great channel anyway. Um, and uh, yeah, check out check out his video on Red. Like, that's, that's the kind of energy I love. Is that like, well, what if we did this silly thing? <laughs> and it looks great. It looks great. He added value. To, now he can resell it for more money. And yes, I have a can I can I love ten days as a house flipper idea. Uh, I just haven't hammered it down yet. I have a couple that are around real estate, and I just I need to get them to be not too complicated. Right now, I have a I have the whole real realtor. Can I love ten days as a realtor? I've got the I've got the um, title sequence and everything done. I've got the thumbnails. I've got all that ready. What I don't have is the pricing system on the houses so that they're not too complicated. So I'm still working on it. That one's coming at some point. Okay, I see something right away I want to spend money on. This flower. This stuff will come in handy. So put me down. Now we're at 20. And I need to check on recording time. Uh, we're about where I like to be. I think I'm going to search this house.
And were I to redo this series a second time, I think I need to add something to like the money changes. I do think you need to do use it or lose it. Um, uh, because later, once you've solved some of your problems, it, you're gonna you're not gonna spend twenty dollars a day. So you're gonna end up banking more and you can more. Always money. use more food. Yeah, I'll take that. Because now I'm looking at this as ways to get a cooking skill. I'm spending two dollars to raise my cooking skill. Um, so I feel like no, nah, I don't know about that though. I feel like maybe you need assistance. You either need to have less money per day. But in the beginning, it was easy to spend twenty dollars. So I don't know if you institute some sort of inflation system where everything is four dollars after like day three. I don't know, or maybe you just get less money. I'd love to take another run at this, because uh, I I like this idea. I like this concept. I think this has been fun. No, I'm not taking that. Uh, I still don't know the next series because the next series is going to be a map deep dive. Right now, HRV is slightly stash. ahead of uh, Forsaken Airfield. But I haven't closed the voting yet, so it might be closed by the time this, this, uh, this one comes out. No, no, I don't think so. Yes, yes, yes. I will never say no to a sewing kit. I am a repair addict. Down to 16. Is that everything? Wait, there's no upstairs to this house? <laughs> I never noticed that before. This house is really small. I'm like, all right, let's go check upstairs. Wait, there is no upstairs. There's no, what, there's no matches? What is this? What is this? Jackrabbits, what are you guys doing? Over here. You're killing me, Smalls. I can take rose hips. They don't cost anything. Oop. All right. I think uh, I will take this one here. Let's head back in. Next time, we will probably go to um, Misanthropes, and then we'll head towards... We'll, we'll make a call. Oh, there's the matches. How did I miss them? I'm always taking matches. Six dollars. What are we here? Um, next time, we'll make a decision. Are we going to go towards Mystery Lake or are we going to go towards DP? Uh, maybe Misanthropes will, will make the decision for us. I really don't think we're going to find a hacks on there, but whatever. Um, so yeah, so let's see. Uh, that's going to do it for this one. Wait, I need, I need to go out and go back in so that I save that I took the matches. There we go. Okay, where are we at? We are on day six, probably approaching day seven. And uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for this one. This has been a lot of fun. Again, my apologies on the lost part. Um, it is what it is. Uh, like I said, I'm in the no regret phase of my life. I feel bad that it happened, but you know, we move on. Uh, thanks so much for watching, for all the support, for all the comments. You guys are awesome. I really, really appreciate you. I hope you have a great day and I'll be back tomorrow with more adventures in the long dark. Until then, stay safe, take care of each other. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.